Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred On, outside the lane where we just beat West Ham 4-1. I've got Dan and Daryl with me, guys. You must have watched Spurs a lot in your lifetimes. That was as good as it gets, really, wasn't it? Absolutely, absolutely. I think at the moment, you know, the defensive unit at the back there, particularly between Vertonghen and... Um yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we're looking very, very solid. You know, I think that the partnership, obviously playing for Belgium, helps an awful lot. Um, and they look very good. And Danny Rose has improved hugely over the last year on the defensive side of his game. So I think we're looking rock solid. And obviously, all good things start from the back. When you've got the defence right, good things come from that. And we're seeing that over the last three months. You know. Yeah, absolutely. And Eric Dyer just in front of them. You know, yeah, when it's... when we haven't got the ball, he can act as almost like a third centre back. And his, I have to say, I've been totally shocked by how good he is on the ball as well. Much better than I expected. Absolutely. I mean, we, we've got a number there, which I think could have won man of the match. I really don't know who, should, who, who won one man of the match. Harry Kane, you might say, with two goals. Moussa Dembele, I mean, they've released the beast, yeah. haven't they? I mean, he is a, a, a different player. I, you know, in previous seasons, he wouldn't have lasted 90 minutes. Mm -hmm. He's fit as a fiddle now. I mean, Son played extremely well yeah. for somebody who's not been in the squad a lot um, or not been on the, on, on the pitch a lot. So I think there's looking like a real balance, you know, when you say, oh, I have seen Spurs for many, many years, and there's looking like a real balance yeah. there. And, and the youth and the fitness coming through is just destroying teams. I mean, that should have been 7-0. Yeah. We gifted them a goal. And, um, you it's, know, not an, it's not an exaggeration to say that could have been 7-8 or 9-0 and it eight, would have been absolutely fair. Any score we would have wanted there. So just to say, you know, come on the Spurs, we'll br bring on the Chelsea. Uh, let's hope they don't give us an upset because it would be an upset if yeah. they got anything from here next week. Uh, you know, we'd like a nice 2 0 I think, would, yeah. would be safe. I, I genuinely think, like, with that fitness that we show and the pace and the dynamism a lot of Chelsea's players are quite old and they're not going to fancy doing 90 minutes of that absolutely I think I think also what's key to us at the moment is obviously we could do without this trip Thursday night in Russia I think that's that's something we could really do without and I think ideally if possible we'd like to see a midfield maybe of sort of Mason Bentaleb if he's fit and Lamella out there you know just to give a bit of rest to those players that will always be key for next Sunday you know if we're to beat Chelsea obviously we've got a great chance we're playing well we're looking great at the moment um, let's just hope we don't step up against them because I would hate that I must say yeah I guess because Ali's suspended against Chelsea he can play against Carabag so that'll actually give us a better chance in that game uh, predictions just one word predictions again for the Chelsea match I said 2-0 yeah. and that's the way I'd like sticking it sticking with 2-0 oh, I'd like to think we could just edge them out 2-1 I think I think it'll be a very tight game and I've got a horrible feeling they're due a flagship victory but I hope it's not coming next week so yeah let's hope he doesn't Mourinho us like he did in that cup final by playing absolutely. Zuma and, yeah. and just sorting us out with that Maybe but just give a little quick message to Ben Ben, where were you? 4-1, West Ham. Hope you enjoyed it at home on the box. Yeah, we'll make sure we don't edit that out, mate. Uh, guys, uh, let us know if you agree with what they had to say in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and follow us on Twitter at TV. Thanks, guys. Brilliant.